got another unboxing for you guys on YouTube. Um, here's the box. Inside is an HP ML 115G5 server. Basically, it's just a PC. Um, the difference between just a normal PC and this, um, it's got more hard drive base. You can install up to four hard drives. It's got more um, RAM slots. You know, it has four of those as well, and it's got. I'm I'm not sure how many, but quite a few PCI slots and five and a quarter inch bays on the front. But that's why they call this a server rather than just a, a standard PC. Another thing, it doesn't come with an operating system. Um, it should just have a, a blank hard drive with nothing on. I'm going to install Windows Server 2008 on this thing, which I've got a free copy of from Microsoft DreamSpark. Um, if you're a student, you can get that too. So. As usual, I apologize for the bad viewing angle for this unboxing. I just tried to make it as good as possible, but it's it's hard with where the camera is. So, I got this from eBuyer. Um, £210-ish I paid for it. Annoyingly, the day after it went down by £10. now I haven't got around to actually opening it I can't actually use it properly yet anyway because being a server it doesn't have any kind of Wi-Fi or wireless um, card built in and obviously it would be silly to connect to a network with a server by Wi-Fi and there isn't an available Ethernet port where this where this server is going to go? Okay. Anyway, stick to the unboxing, Jake. A bag here with a lot of stuff in. We've got the power cable there. Um, it's actually got a mouse in there. I wasn't sure if it came with a mouse or not. And I'm guessing there's a keyboard in the next box. I did have a keyboard and mouse ready in case it didn't. Okay, so to a PS2 mouse, um, very simple. If I just get a bit closer to the camera and show you that, just two buttons, scroll wheel, black HP on it. It's oh my god, it's actually got a trackball on the bottom, so quite an old mouse, really. And there's the the old you know, port for that there, so no, not USB. Okay, so the power cable, standard one there. So there's the easy setup CD. I'm not sure what's on there. Drivers and configuration files. Um, read this first. Do not use assisted install with software read enabled. Okay. And an installation sheet there. Right. Next thing in this box, is there going to be a keyboard? Yes, it is. Keyboard looks a bit more modern, uh, slightly, than the mouse. This again, no USB in sight there. I suppose that's a good thing. It'll save USB ports for other things. Nice, simple keyboard. Nothing special, but at least it's it has come with a, a keyboard and mouse. I wasn't sure if it was going to. The specs on all the websites that sell this thing are really vague. Quite a big keyboard <laughs> in comparison with my Apple wireless keyboard. Right, the server itself. There it is. Not sure how to take this out. And it's going to be one of these things that are just impossible to get out by myself. I'll try. 
see, I, I pull that, the whole box comes up. That's just brilliant. Hmm. Maybe if I turn it on its side. The instructions on the box actually just say pull it out. Which clearly doesn't work. This, however, does. I'm doing my best not to drop it and break it. Slowly pull it out. So this is the first PC I've brought in um, a long time, well, first PC I've ever bought with, like, my money. But this will be used as a surfer, I won't be using this as a computer. Sorry if I'm boring you, I'll get this out eventually. There we go. Right. It's kind of completely held, it's held off the ground by this polystyrene. So if I just... take that bit out and put that down and take this side out. There we go. I nearly dropped it, but it's fine. Right, quite big really, um, but you'd expect it to be for a server. Um, I don't know how I can show you this. So it's just a standard kind of case. Not rack mountable or anything. Right. <laughs> My paper. Wait. Put that down. Move this stuff off my desk. And hopefully I'll be able to put it up here. A lovely unorganized video as usual. Okay, hopefully this won't break my desk. It's not too heavy. Um, I wouldn't describe it as light either. Okay. There's the front. Got a CD, DVD drive, an optical drive there, power button. Um, I can't see properly. I think there are two USB ports there and a lot of vents down the front. Um, turn it around. So we've got power, a fan, some more ventilation fan port things. Um, the PS2 port to the mouse and keyboard. Right there, I can't see. Um, VGA is that serial? I think. Um, yeah, that that'll be serial, and then we've got four USB ports and the Ethernet port, and it's four PCI cards on the bottom. I think there might be PCI Express, actually, something like that. Okay, so that's the unboxing. <laughs> Where can I put this thing? You probably expect at least a a few videos based around that thing in the next few weeks. So that's the HP um, to Pro Liant or Pro Liant, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, ML115G5. The specs, I don't think I mentioned, I'm not 100% sure, I think it's got a 2.2 gigahertz AMD quad core processor, 1 gigabyte of RAM, a 160 gigabyte hard drive. Um, what have I done with my mouse? I think that's it. The, <clears throat> the most important specs that that you need to know.
um, like I said, up to four hard drives, um, up to three terabytes altogether. Um, yeah, that's about it. So, with Windows Server 2008 installed, it should be quite a nice machine. It's not going to be in here um, because obviously I want to be able to sleep at night, and a server wouldn't be a good thing to put in a bedroom. So, there we go. <laughs> my website is jakewright.net. Um, well, my email address is jake at jakewright.net if you want to contact me, ask me something about this. Um, tell me something about this. <laughs> Maybe I've got the specs completely wrong. Um, my website, you'll find the live stream. I'm recording this video live right now. And there's a live IRC chat to go with that, full of geeks. <coughs> I'll talking about servers right now since obviously I've just unboxed one. That can the, the IRC channel, irc.geekshed.net, the channel is hash Jake. Uh, my website you'll find all that and more, jakewright.net. Thanks for watching.